Hello and welcome back. So we are having Nasdaq 100X simply sitting up over there for for breakup. So yesterday we were expecting Nasdaq 100X to draw for another leg lower within that video analysis. Let's just simply go to that and uh, quickly watch that, and then we're gonna I'm slightly gonna force forward that, and then we're gonna come back. All right. So we are having a breakup opportunity over there, Nasdaq 100X ahead of the CPI numbers. I'm gonna go I'm gonna look at this lower time frame for our time frame yeah so there so we were you know expecting uh, another leg lower yesterday yeah so that leg came out over there but it didn't fall all the way up to this area right and then then recover so the momentum is slowing down over there okay which is just simply setting up for another breakup it's a good sign that uh, we are still looking for the next leg higher on the Nasdaq candidate X so our formation is turning something like that okay we are having a slightly bigger Flat flag formation, the ABC formation, like this. Okay, maybe another leg lower and then breakout, or we may see, you know, next leg starting to continue to keep pushing more higher from current price. Okay, so the setup is going to be on a lower time frame. So you are looking for short term opportunities first. All right, so we still may see another leg lower today during the New York session. So we, we still can see breakout and, and drag lower price, still can visit this this low or new low. And, and this is. Yeah, if, if we see that one more leg lower, then you are planning for this short term trade and possible breakout and continuation for more upside. If you don't that get one more leg lower, then you are watching this breakout, very, very aggressive breakout to happen and continue and keep pushing more higher all the way up to the previous top. All right. So that's what you are watching today on the Nasdaq 100X. Okay, we are still within the, the bearish trend, short term bearish trend, and price is still running within that, uh, you know, wedge. So we still may see another leg lower. All right, this one more leg lower can appear over there. If it comes, you are watching new lower low and looking for it to buy. If you don't get that, then simply break out and 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 leave those moving averages and continue to keep pushing more higher. So we need strong breakout over there and uh, buying opportunity. So I wouldn't suggest you to chase that. So I would suggest you to let the price tag this low or new low. All right, thanks. Okay, so that was the yesterday. That was the yesterday. You know, setup was building over there on uh, Nasdaq 100 index. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the bigger time frame. Nothing changed on that. We're still looking for this to go all time high daily. You know, correction, uh, correction still over there on a eight hour time frame. Yeah, so slightly went lower than the moving averages. Started from a four hour time frame. If I'm gonna look at the lower time frame, simply on this one hour time frame it seems still a correction for another leg lower okay we are not having a strong buying momentum over there 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 we clearly can see that we are not having strong aggressive buying momentum so we still can see another leg lower okay very much similar like this previous one so you are looking for buys every time and it comes to new lows okay right now um you uh, right now not looking for this but you are if you are not into the trade then you are looking for another leg lower and then looking for buy so if you caught the trade already from these lows all right so during the cpa report you are looking it to break out and continue and keep pushing more higher all the way up to the to the to the previous uh four hour time frame okay if you don't get that then another leg and then then and, and another leg lower and then new lows and then bounce back so if i'm going to look at the or our time frame so we are still expecting the chart is very much clear on this this area okay we are still expecting it to go all the way bounce back go all the way up to this area all right first this bigger you know abc move to breakout and in best case scenario go all the way up to the you know all time high so that's what we are looking for the short term trades are all short short term tra trades are already building over there within the this wedge as shown on lower time frame thank you